Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Today I would like to present about uh, one of Islamic banking product focusedly in Bank Islam Malaysia Berhad which is uh, personal financing. So before I go deeper into my presentation, I would like to highlight some issue regarding this uh, personal financing uh, which is first uh, customer uh, cannot distinguish uh, between personal financing or personal loan. And the second issue is uh, customer do not know the type of personal financing offered by bank. And the third is customer do not know benefit and features of personal financing. So today I would like uh, to discuss regarding this issue of the personal financing and also uh, personal loan. Okay. The comparison between personal financing and personal loan, I would like to highlight in this slide, which is we go to the features, which is term four. Basically, personal financing is refer to the Islamic product, and then personal loan is refer to the conventional product. So, as we Muslim. We could, uh, we should know the difference between this term. Okay, the second is uh, practice. For the personal financing, uh, practice is avoid interest-based transaction, which is riba, and based on underlying asset. And for personal loan, uh, the practice is lender lend to borrower uh, to make profit from the interest charge on the principal amount, and the contract use. For the personal financing is uh, Tawaru and also Komoditi Morabaha. And then the contract for the personal loan is interest-based contract. So basically, we can conclude that the personal financing is uh, used for Islamic banking product. And the personal loan is uh, used for conventional products. So we go to the personal financing description. A description. What is personal financing? So I would like to share with you uh, Bank Islam Malaysia Berhad uh, personal financing I facility, which is uh, means that uh, unsecure or secure term financing to meet financial needs, which is calculated based on floating rate. Okay. For personal financing, uh, I facility in Bank Islam Malaysia Berhad, uh, the syariah concept used is uh, tawaru. So the contract used in, the, in this uh, personal financing offered by Bank Islam is tawaru. So we can look that tawaru concept used uh, by the Bank Islam or all of uh, Islamic bank is consists of two sale of contracts. Okay, firstly, uh, purchase of commodities by customer of Bank Islam based on the concept of murabaha, which is a cost plus profit, at the bank deferred sale price. In the process, purchase will be made by Bank Islam at the purchasing agent on behalf of the customer. Then. The customer is responsible for paying the amount due from the murubaha transaction in accordance in accordance with the term agreed upon. The second is Bank Islam as a sale agent on behalf of the customer is responsible to sell the commodities to other commodity buyers at the cost price of which is referred to the financing amount. So the commodity means that any commodity acceptable to Bank Islam such as palm oil, plastic resin, rubber, cocoa bean, soil bean, timber and metal excluding gold and silver traded at any commodity trading platform approved by Bank Islam. So I will show you an illustration from uh, issue bank bank uh, issue by Bank Negara Malaysia uh, for the Tawaruk uh, contract, which is 
we can see that uh, from the illustration, for example, a customer requires financing of 100,000 from the IFI, which is referred to Islamic Financial Institution. Upon this request, the IFI execute the Tawaruk arrangement. So the first step is the IFI purchase the asset with selling price of 100,000 from asset supplier one. And the second is the, the IFI pays cash to asset supplier one. And the third is subsequently, the IFI sell the asset to the customer at the at an agreed selling price of 120,000 uh, plus with profit uh, 100,000 and plus with profit uh, 20,000. And the fourth is customer makes deferred payment through monthly installment for a period of five years. And the fifth, subsequently the customer appoint the IFI as its agent to sell the asset to asset supplier two on the spot at selling price of 100,000. Lastly, the customer obtain a cash of 100,000 required for the financing. So basically, is an illustration uh, released by Bank Negara Malaysia uh, for Tawaruk contract. Okay, we go to the BIMB Personal Financing I facility. Bank Islam uh, targeted market is focused on government servant first. The second is semi-government servant. The third is private sector. And the fourth, professional program. So, the personal financing that offered by Bank Islam is target on that uh, group. So, the criteria uh, to be choose, uh, to, to choose the client or customer is the bank will uh, go through the CITOS and secrets of the client. And the third is pre-screening will be made by the bank, uh, either the customer, uh, the, either the customer can get the personal financing. Okay. And then we go to the type of personal financing offered by Bank Islam. The first is personal financing for professional program. The second is personal financing I non-package. The third is personal financing I package. So basically, the, uh, there are three types of uh, personal financing offered by, uh, by Bank Islam. So we go to the benefit and features. So basically, the first uh, benefit of uh, or feature by, the, by uh, Bank Islam of these products is uh, first a finance, uh, financing quantum which is based on eligibility limit and subject to minimum amount of 10,000 and maximum amount of 300,000. The second is payment, payment periods. The maximum of 10 years equal to 120 months or up to the retirement age, whichever is earlier. The third is uh, financing rate offer with takaful coverage and also takaful coverage by the uh, bank for the, for the uh, personal financing I facility. And then the fourth, the benefit is uh, the personal financing offered by Bank Islam is competitive rate. Uh, next is no hidden charge by the bank. And lastly, uh, selling price fake and known by the customer. We go to the uh, eligibility and requirements uh, needs to uh, customer apply for this uh, personal financing. First, must be 18 and 20, 25 uh, years old and not exceeding the retirement age. The second is Malaysia, uh, must be Malaysian citizens and the minimum fit income uh, or fee income is 2000 or 3000 3, 3, and, and 500 per month. So, uh, the client must be submit uh, all of the equipment required by the banks. Okay. And lastly, the payment method 
uh, is uh, salary deduction by auto, de auto debit and extending instruction. So the, the document required uh, by the bank to be fulfilled by the client is one, a copy of identity card. Second is latest three month salary slips. Uh, next, latest employer's confirmation letter. And then latest three month bank statement of salary crediting account. Next, additional document for respective professional and at least one of these which is latest income tax form, form B or form EA or EC and any other latest supporting document such, uh, such as EPF statement if required. And then lastly, uh, the fees and charges uh, for apply this uh, personal financing. First, uh, RM50 ringgit for being the customer's agent to sell commodity to the broker and for personal financing I know package the fees and charge is not applicable so I think uh, that's all issue that uh, I discuss today regarding my topic is personal financing offered by Bank Islam Malaysia Berhad thank you